me haters you know how me I use and I can count no me I use good and me I use love no matter how the talk against me and I wish the bad for me I always I wish good for uno as me haters see me way yeah no matter how you hate me me still I say you know me that want him or she get through that program be. God know because she really need it or because him really need it that's how my meds for people you hear that me is a clean hearted youth you hear me tell you youth with me I go suffer you know but let me tell you this we now go suffer for too long you hear that we just a wait on God timing you hear me tell you because you see when God said get the go Remember me I tell you there is no turning back. So no matter how I wish for see me shame, me now nah go shame. Well, what about him? What, what did you what were you expecting to happen today? First man, I rock well. First thing I wanna say, free vibes cartel. <laughs> This today was not a bail application. Let's get that clear. Why? 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 Viewers and subscribers, Wagwan. Wagwan, viewers and subscribers, what's going on? Welcome back to the channel. And uh, as usual, you know, we have a big up all the viewers them and the subscribers around the world. See me? Yeah, man, big up the viewers and the subscribers them. Bless upon yourself, man. You know, we love them like that. We appreciate the item. See me? Yeah. And, and and to the people in the commentary box keeping the commentary box also busy like busy signal is me yeah but i want to say much appreciation seeing we love the them big up with ourselves see and for those who are viewing for the very first time let me welcome you to the channel man seeing we want to say we appreciate the them give thanks big up with ourselves see please do remember to like comment share and to subscribe see it's important people it's important to like comment share and subscribe especially to like and to subscribe it's a very very important we give thanks for the support seeing and we 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 expect and anticipate your continual support see me say big up and say much love so my very beautiful people this very moment we are going to talk about Vibes cartel and, and his co accused and what happened today at the Supreme Court. You understand what happened today at the Supreme Court? So, we are going to talk about the whole entire Vibes cartel thing, what happened at the Supreme Court, and a lot more. It's a bunch of stuff to talk about and to explore. We're going to talk about this and more when we come back, all right? The Supreme Court Judge Justice Andrea Thomas has ruled that dancehall entertainer Vibes Cartel and two of his three co-accused should remain behind bars pending the decision of the Court of Appeal on whether or not they will be retried for the murder of Clive Lizard Williams. Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. And my beautiful people, so today, all right, before I, I talk about that, let me just say this. I get, I realize, I realize that a lot of our YouTubers are idiots. Yes, they know themselves, people. A lot, a lot of our YouTubers, they are idiots. They are idiots, plenty of them. 
don't know what them are do. They don't know what them are say. When they come to certain things, and them, the, some of them are helping to keep Vibes Cartel behind bars. Behind bars. And most of them are helping to keep Vibes Cartel behind bars. It's best most of them stop the talking. Okay. Another person who I I believe is an no no way is doing either is this liar. I do not believe that this liar understands the entirety of the case and, and words and, and, and the meaning of quashing conviction and all these things. Even some of the YouTubers, they don't understand quashing conviction. Conviction, people. Conviction is the verdict. You understand? They did not, and I said this over and over and over over i am getting tired of having to say this to people who should have overstanding and knowledge in a time like 2024 when 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 it's, it's more easier to learn and to understand what's going on in the world you understand and so vibes cartel and his co-accused were on trial for a crime. Okie dokie. Right. They were on a trial for a crime. They were convicted of the crime and they were given some jail time. Right. Life. They were given life. So, they took the case to the Privy Council and they, uh, they took the case to the Privy Council and the Privy Council quashed the conviction because there were errors leading up to the conviction. Error where jury were bribing jury and this was happening and that was happening and the judge didn't deal with it the right and proper way and so the privy council felt like it shouldn't have gone that way and so they quashed the conviction alright so they quashed the conviction quash the conviction they didn't throw the case they didn't set Vibes Cartel and his co-accused free. All they did was to say, okay, here's the scenario. There was an error in the trial. So because of there was an error in the tri in trial where, where juries are concerned, we don't believe that the verdict of guilt should have stand. You understood? And because the verdict of guilt verdict shouldn't be because of what happened, because of the error, then we're going to have to quash the conviction, which means the conviction is no longer, we are not upholding, we are no longer upholding the conviction. It's been made void. Just the conviction, people. Just the flipping conviction which means they refer the case back to its originality its original form from like day one so the guys are now arrested and accused of a crime and are pending trial all right okay let me say i hope everybody understands that now and i said this in my previous vibes cartel video i said the lie it, today wasn't a bill application, by the way, people. Today, what happened today was I hear I see a lot of YouTubers talk about vibes cartel denied bail, vibes cartel denied bail, blah 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 bail, slap 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 bail, heal this and bail that and bail and bail and Garrett bail and that the bail and all the bail there is. Today wasn't about it wasn't a bill application. This today was not a bail application. Let's get that clear. The liar, to me, doesn't understand what he's doing. That's my belief. And I said this many times. And I said this many times before people. And guess what happened now? 
when I said this, guess what happened? You know what happened? A lot of people, a lot of, a lot of, the, a lot of, the, a lot of the people in the commentary box jump down my throat like hot dumpling, you know. Yes, man. A lot of people fly down by my throat, fly down by my throat like a hot dumpling out of pot. And I say, oh, that is why you are not Vibes Cartel. Because I said if I was Vibes Cartel lawyer, you would be a home. So you know what they do? Let me tell you how most Jamaicans stay. Plenty Jamaicans. Let me tell them stay. When it comes to dealing with certain things, them, them prefer Mr. Jacket and Tide than the man named T-shirt. You understand me, I say? Yes, man. And we always been doing this. Um, they, this man could be a bush doctor. Just in a piece of old jeans or a khaki pants and a, a, a bad color t-shirt. And, and, and this person is ill. And this man could be telling you what to do to get yourself well. But you don't believe him. You know who you believe? The man has a long white bush jacket. With him sitting over here, so say my doctor. And him, you believe, you know. And him pack you up with nothing but tablets after tablets after tablets. And you never get well. You never ever get well. And the man with the right remedy, but because him, you see him as Mr. Nobody, because him in this dirty piece of your khaki trousers and jeans and the washout bad color shot. And so we always be like that. So because me, you not know, just up in a jacket suit every day and they are quotas, when me talk, a lot of people, only the sensible one, only the smart people would say, yes, you, you know where I say, where I say, right there. You, 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 you have common sense. Only the smart people. But you have the silly billy ones, they always jump up and say, then criticize me, you know. Them criticize me and say, that's why you're not a vibe scout, a lawyer, and blah, 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 blah. And, and one of them fly along and say, how oh, dare you to say vibe scout, Vibes Cartelier doesn't understand and don't believe he understands everything. Because first of all, if he had understands everything and know the law and how these things work, he wouldn't apply for, what's it say, apply for? A habeas corpus. It means asking for Vibes Cartel and his co accused to be, re to be released. No, tell me, how the hell that would, that's going to happen? That, as, as bad as cat would have said, that would never happen. That can never happen. I told the liar, I said, liar, it's best if you make, if it's best if you make a bail application. Yes. You're requesting bail. You can't ask him for these people to be released after they've been accused of a crime. It's stupid. It is stupid, Bridget. And if you go back and watch my even my last video my about Vibes Carter case, I said this, brother. I said if you went to the court talking about asking for them to be released, they're going to shut you guys down and make the liar look like him is an idiot beard. And that's what they've done today. They shut him down and make him look stupid. Him look so silly. Like, like you know what I mean? Bail was a thing. I told the guy, I said, listen, you could apply for bail. And then when you make your bill application, it would be up to the court to look into certain things and to make judgment on whether or not they should grant or deny bill. Today wasn't about bill. So all the YouTubers, them and all them little people are about vibes got to deny bill. Uh, stop it. It wasn't about bill today. It was about asking for vibes got to be released. Released and bill. Release and bail is too different thing you bail is when you make a bill application for the guys to be outside with sureties to return to court asking for them to be released is like say let them go them free them blah 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 asking for to be released on what grounds brother released on what grounds you can't say what the privy court to quash the conviction so they are free no it doesn't work like that they are not free they are not free they are to stand trial retrial unless the court the the, the, the supreme court 
decide otherwise say, okay we are not going to go for a reach we're gonna just blah 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 but you can get up and say release these people because privy council quash conviction the privy council quash only the conviction which means you have to do a retrial if you check the whole thing if you go ask google i don't think google got sleep yet you understand me and 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 so many people just behave like them silly and make the rest of jamaicans look silly and i told these people you know see the amount of people pack up at the supreme court today for the ruling you see the amount of people we pack up for the ruling let me tell you when the liar him smart the liar shall just go to boom and brace the 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 um The hearing is set for June 10th. The hearing to decide whether or not they're going to go for a retrial is June 10th. Which means today is, it, is um, January, February, March, April, May 30th. Today is May the 30th, right? Which means you have 11 days, May 31st and then 10 more days. 11 days before the hearing and to decide whether or not there's going to be a retrial or not all right so the last just say okay vibes cartel listen sit back hold tight we're gonna wait until the after the hearing when the hearing and if they decide to do a retrial then we will make a bill application you see what i say i yo listen to me Listen to me. It takes smart people. Smart liar. Liar must be clever. Liar have to be very clever. Me know. And our braggadocious. Me no got no bag of university, you know. I me never, but me study a certain things. During my time in Great Britain, I study a lot of things. I actually went to college in Great Britain. And I study a lot of things, brother. I read a lot. I used to watch. I, one time, one time I hear, one time I hear, I used to watch, um, 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 what is it called, program called? The First 48. I used to watch that. And one of my, one of my ex can testify, said, I'm, I'm not lying. One of my ex, if you call up right now, she could say, yes, it's true. Me and her, we used to, we used to, we used to watch the first 48 every single night, brethren. The first 48 was a, was a program about um, law and criminal act activities and, and law and order and all these other things. And how them, them solve cases and, and big cases, all sorts of cases, big cases. You understand? M U R D E R cases and all them type of cases. Eh? You understand? And I, I used to watch it every single night. No joke. You understand? And learn a lot of things. You get me? And that is how I know. Say, Vibes Cartel Liar, the first one who got him convicted in the first place, did not do a good job. He didn't. He did not do a good job. Because first of all, when he went, when they went and for, um, to trial, you you should have asked the court to prove the crime that they, they that your client is accused of. You understand? Yeah. You should have asked the court to prove the crime. You should be like your honor. I'm not objecting to the charges. But before you could charge my client for any crime, I would like the court to prove to me that the crime that they are charging my client for actually occurred. Okay? And if the court cannot prove 
the crime. You can't show me the evidence. Say, okay, you charge my client for a thing called M U R D E R. Then there has got to be a lifeless body. Can you please present the lifeless body so we could actually? They cannot. And that is why I am asking the court to let my client go home because you cannot charge a person for a crime that you cannot prove. You understand? And they didn't do that. They went and do this and that job for one bag and answer story. I mean, vote vice note and all these things. And I told these people, and next thing again, people, the justice system, the, the, the people behind the whole thing, it's not just what them accuse cartel for. Them are all cartel for, you know. I said this many, many times. Them are, they, there's only using this because them know say, you cannot go around this. You can't say, okay, we breach, them are breach human rights or them are breach human wrongs or cartel human rights has been violated. They know you can't come with that because he's an accused. In fact, he was a convicted. He was a convict. He was convicted. He was a convict. Luckily for him, the Privy Council quashed the conviction. Aight. But he is still an accused. So he is he, he, he's now an accused. He went back to being just an accused. Which means he's under arrest. Aight. So... This is bigger than crayfish. This is bigger than wheel. You understand? Don't believe they just having cartel just for this. They're using this to 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 minimize cartel's power, cartel's influence, and society, the youths, the overs. And who can see that? Them no can see nothing. We know these things, youth. Now, go. That's a real thing. And the, the, I tell the people, say, yo, just behave as if you care zero about Vibes Cartel and see what's happened. But every time I talk, nobody listens. Nobody listens. Everybody think me a chat fat. It take wisdom. Wisdom to observe and to analyze activities and, and decisions and, and, and you know all these things Start, yo listen to me and the people are the reason why cartel I figure wait until June 10 because I know they was going to let him wait I know they were they, they going to release him they now not release him they are thinking about retrial. Once you see them, they go and they they they, they, they not release him. They say the court says the judge says he must. Judge left the courtroom just a short while ago. I'm actually waiting to get a written copy of the judgment because she gave quite a, a detailed breakdown of her reasons. As you said, in short, cartel and its co-accused will not be released before the court of appeal has decided whether there is going to be a retrial or not. So the the judge looked at a number of issues. She started out by looking at the issue as to whether the decision of the Privy Council that their convictions had been quashed and that the Court of Appeal was to decide on a retrial, did that translate into an order for them to be released? And she, she decided that that did not, in fact, so translate. She looked at whether or not the appeal had been determined and her decision was no, the appeal has not finished. It is not going to be finished until the Court of Appeal makes its final decision. Since the appeal has not been determined, therefore, she said that the men are in fact being held lawfully in custody because the Commission of Corrections has not received any order from any court to release them. She looked at the issue of whether the charges remain and decided that yes, the charges are still valid. So the men are still charged. Having looked at that, she then looked at whether in fact they would be eligible for bail. So she looked at the new bail act and she looked at the fact that the bail act says that to be eligible for bail 
while you are waiting for your appeal to be decided. You would have to have been on bail before you were convicted. These men were not on bail before convicted. She also pointed to another provision in the Bail Act that says that people who have been convicted for murder are in any case not in the category of people who could be considered for bail pending appeal. So as a result, they wouldn't be eligible for bail. She then looked at the fact that this was a habeas corpus application. Habeas corpus literally means bring the body, but bring the body before the court. It's usually used in circumstances where people are being unlawfully detained. And she said a habeas corpus application like this can't be used to circumvent the proper processes of the court. And that in this particular case, the only court who can make a decision at this time in relation to the liberty of these men is the Court of Appeal because that is where the matter now is. So in short, Milton, to, to um, end as we began, no, the men, Cartel and his court huge, are not going to be released before the decision of the Court of Appeal as to whether they should be retried or not. To remain, he should remain in custody until the hearing, which is June 10, the hearing, if they're going to do a retrial, which I am 99%, 99.9, I am 99.9% sure that they are going for a retrial. So, what Mr. Isaac Buchanan needs to do is just bill and wait till June 10. They're going to go for a retrial, they guarantee they're going to do a retrial, and then he can apply for bail. You understand? I'm not sure if bail will be granted. I'm not sure if it will be granted. You understand? But I'm just saying. And that's what he should have done in the first place when he run gonna about obvious. Why abuse? What they call it? We can't even pronounce the word people, but when him say him, 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 he should have done that. But release vibes cartel. Release, release, re release. Under what grounds, bruv? Under what grounds? You not go like that, man. You're silly. You're a silly liar. And I'm saying it, and I mean no disrespect, but I just have to use this term. It's just, it's just stupid. You should have never gone about to release cartel. You should have waited until June 10. And whatever they decide, if they decide they're going to do a retrial, then you apply for bail. If they decide that they won't do a retrial, then you know, say, okay, you'll be coming out. You understand? But um, they're going to do a retrial. They are going for a retrial. You understand? Because you know, talk up on the mode on the internet and make the DPP look like they are idiots. And make the, the Supreme Court look like they are idiots and the local courts look like they are idiots and, and so they are going to discipline somebody. I'm not quite sure who it's going to be but they are going to you know, just ain't going to school Mr. Isaac Buchanan. She's going to school him. She's going to school him because she realizes that he don't understand the whole thing. This is bigger than Mr. Isaac Buchanan in my opinion. bigger than him you see me and they just some matters where it's a poor vibes cartel but vibes cartel is a guy who i'm not uh, i'm not even gonna say that because i'm not i'm not sure if he was a graduate they say he attended calabar but i'm not sure if he was a graduate you understand but, seriously speaking, my beautiful people, seriously speaking, I tell them to prepare for a retrial. And, and it's, 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 everybody can see now, they say, I was the one who was right all along. I'm the one, all this woman who come out did a day when they call herself, where, where is she now? Where is she? Uh, what she call herself? Um... Um, what she call herself? Angel or something like that. She call herself Angel. Come out and I make up a crocus bag and nice and I And I said to you people, said this woman. What I said, I even asked Vibes Carter to remove the post from his IG because what this woman is doing now, what she's just done, is driven another nail in your coffin as it relates to you not coming out. 
You understand? That's how she did. When she go back, up a bag of lies, but on the free vibes castle and blah, 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 me no care who I'm big. Where is she now? Where is she now? Why is she saying? And I said, this woman need to shut it. And the most of the people call themselves Gaza Nation, they need to shut it. They need to shut it. It takes smart people. Smart, not a bag of chattings and disrespecting the state and the people who have the upper hand. You can't do that. Even the guy who them call them 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 say is an ex prisoner or whatever. Even him come out and him said, say, yo, brother, the best thing I can do is to approach this thing from a different angle and, and be more, you know, be more respectful and kind of apologize to the DPP and and literally beg them. But go on like your big bad and bull and try to live up to your, your manica, but real boss and all them something there. You're making matters worse, man. You make the matters worse for yourself, bro. But you could be coming out. And you should be smart enough because I heard you sing sang it in most most of your song. Them say you're the smart one. You should be more clever and just tell it. You say, listen, I don't need you people to be campaigning and try about free no world, but I don't need that at this precise moment because it's not working. You understand? It's not working. It's not, it's not working. I understand. It's not working. The only the truth can set any person free. Only the truth will set you free. Only the truth can set any person free. So without the truth, we won't be free. Speak the truth. Now, attorneys for the men had filed a habeas corpus application requesting their release following the recent Privy Council decision to quash their convictions. Today's activity in the court, as I said, was not a bail application. It was a habeas corpus application on behalf of cartel Sean, Sean Storm Campbell and Andre St. John, which was heard before just... Um, so at this moment now, based upon what happened today, you see the day come down, they went to get the, 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 the Vibes Cartel lawyer applied for Vibes Cartel to be released and the court shut it down, the Supreme Court shut it down and said no, this guy and his co-accused must remain in custody until the day of the ruling which is approximately 11 days from now. Understand? So in the next 11 days, it's gonna be they're gonna be the, the, the decision making June 10th as to whether or not there will be a retrial. And based upon all the events that has happened so far, it's quite evident that there is going to be a retrial. And the only thing Vibes Cartel Defense Team can do after June 10th is to make a bail application and to Keep fingers crossed and hope to God that they will give him some bill. But until then, until then, he has to remain in custody, all of them. And it's a liar fault. I blame the liar. If you are a liar, you know, have full knowledge of the old thing and how it works and have, have common sense and wisdom and to know, say, all right then. An experience too. Maybe this is his first big case. Probably high profile case. His first big high profile case. This is a this is a small case. You know, this is a big. This is a very 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 huge high profile case. You understand? The M U R D E R trial of Vibes Cartel, aka Adija Palmer. And his co accused Sean Storm and the others. It's not a small case. It's not no thief bully beef in a, in a supermarket case. It's not no thief chicken back run a Miss Mary case. This is not no crocus bag of flour from used supermarkets. You understand? This is a high 
profile case. See them out of security with them have up and down a curly whole place today at the courthouse and lock down things and make sure say everything circumspect. The whole courthouse is on a tight security. You see what happened today? Also outside, special security measures were activated at the Supreme Court in downtown Kingston ahead of this afternoon's ruling on whether or not Vibes Cartel and two of his three co accused would be released. There were armored personal carriers. Members of the police SWAT team had created a cordon around the court. So you know so this is not nothing normal. It's just a big eye profile, profile case. And I think it's too big for Mr. Isaac Buchanan. I think it's too big. He needs he need a bigger liar, bigger experienced liar with wisdom and witty, wittiness, very wittiness, clever. You have to, a liar must be clever because sometimes play by the book of law doesn't work and you have to use cleverness sometimes to, to, to get somebody out. Cleverness. You understand? And I said to myself, as this to me is as, as, as high profile as the case might be, is a simple scenario to me. Simple, come on, simple maths. A simple maths, a simple one, two, three. Simple maths. Okay, sometimes you have to exercise patience. Sometimes you have to have patience, even if you're never born in a hospital. You have to have patience sometimes. You understand? Waiting game play peers sometimes when you play the waiting game, wait on the right time to strike. You understand? And I'm saying that like when I'm set a date of ruling for June 10th, the liar should say, Okay, this is what you're gonna do, Vibes Cartel. We're going to wait until June 10th. We we'll go to the ruling, and if they rule for a retrial, then we make a bail application. So let's sit tight and let's just wait and see what happens on June 10th. Applying for guys to be released is, 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 is almost idiotic. It is almost idiotic. That will never happen. Where? Are you crazy? You understand? So I don't know why did Mr. Buckingham think say him who him think him is say you apply for the boys to be released not no gossip brother you understand so make we sit tight now people and watch her go on until say june 10 which is 11 days from now and he see what the ruling is is going to be i think i believe there's going to be a retrial you understand i believe they're going to rule a retrial you know what i mean and he's going to stand trial again these people ain't playing they're not playing so if we just go say so when they rule for retrial, if they rule for retrial, then the liar, Mr. Bo you can make a bail application and see if they will grant bail. And then you know you can take grand bail, you come out and refresh your, your heavens and, and you know free your spirit and then prepare to go to retrial. That's all it is. And I've been saying this ever all so long, but true, me and a big liar, true me and me and me and Tom Tavares and me and our Tanta Varis, our men of Buck Isaac Buck and our men what 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 my money name? <laughs> DK Dunk and uh, KD Knight, KD Knight. Two men of KD Knight and them people. Eh? Nobody wanna listen to me. But this the stone where the builder refuse always turn out to be the head kind of stone. Look how many people are gonna start to listen to me you now when I speak. Cause me I speak with sense, me study things. I mean, I just run, come talk to me, I look views and likes. No. I study things. You understand the people? Be very beautiful people. Big up in yourself. See? Yes. Big up in yourself. And, like me always say, if you can't say good, no say nothing. You understand? If you can't say good, no say nothing. Um... We just gonna keep fingers crossed and watch and wait until June 10 and see what's what what the outcome will be or the day will come down and then we take it from there. If it's a retrial, we prepare to go for retrial and if they said no retrial, they're free to go. We say Ipi Pure, one the governor, you understand? But until then, 
Until then, look after yourself and each other. Regular than this, me, I'm take you to the smile and play blind to it. Be please, if you change, only thing no change, I want the pandemic. Pandemic, me see, I went me have a learn. If you stop sorry for people and put myself first, when me have a learn. If you stop sorry for some people, some people. You see, I when me have a learn. If you stop smiling, you don't like me. I'm a no man, don't forget my back turn. When me have a learn. If you stop sorry for some people, some people. Those who give hundred cell that's so dark me is in them my heart, me rims and some a smile for live. All that we could learn even though the class is big. Play a fool for catch why is that so smart me is. Always I make them pin it and I put off my kids ask them a who catch them when them jump off the bridge. Now like them people you pass we can hard pan a rocket send it off so far it is. Need a college you go come and feel it this more than once me give them 100% with zero balance. Never did make no sense me give them what me have. A fussy, the whole of the same crap in a bag. When we have a learn, we stop sorry for people and put myself first. When we have